it's not like most. My mom wasn't a cook. My grandparents didn't have a kitchen. I didn't start as a dishwasher when I was 14. I don't have that cool story. Um, I was born in Florida in a town that wasn't great, a small town. Um, not a lot of not a lot of diversity. It's like a lot of white people and, and old people in strip malls. And um, I really wanted more. I wanted to get out of the city or out of the, out of where I was at. And uh, I had some friends that were moving up here, and I just on a whim was like, "Dude, I'm just gonna come with you." I gave my parents like a two week notice. I'm like, "I'm moving to New York in two weeks." I was like 19. I'm like, "I gotta get out of here." I didn't know what I wanted to do. Um, I worked at a restaurant at the time. I loved it. I wasn't passionate about food. It was Johnny Leverock Seafood House. So it was like. It was like a chain Florida seafood restaurant, and um, we fried a lot of fish. Um, and it was fun. I liked the environment of the kitchen, but I wasn't like passionate about food, per se. I loved cooking. Uh, my mom was a single mother, and she cooked for me tonight, and so like it was fun for me to cook with her. Um, but I didn't know that that's what I wanted. And at that time too, it wasn't like being a chef wasn't like a thing that was like I don't know. It was like it seemed like out of reach. It didn't seem like seemed very abstract to me. It wasn't like a popular thing to do. So I moved up here in 2000 and I worked at this, I was, I was a skateboarder. I still skate a little bit, but um, I worked at a skate shop for like four years and just like had a fun life. And I skated a lot and had friends and I was in a band and my guitarist was a chef. And um, you know, I was like, dude, I'm tired of selling sh stuff to people. Like I'm just, it's fun, but like it's not fulfilling. I want to, I want to feel fulfilled. And I was actually vegetarian at the time, and I loved cooking with vegetables. And I'd cook for my girlfriend, and it was fun for me. And I was just talking to him, I was like, dude, like, what's it, what is it like to be a chef? Like, like there's something I could maybe possibly feel like I could do. And he went to the CIA. Um, he's like, yeah, go to, go to culinary school. So I, I was in a you know, committed relationship. I didn't want to move upstate um, to Hyde Park. So I was looking for culinary schools um, in New York, and I went, so I saw the FCI. And I, I knew some people who, had gone there and, and spoke highly of it. Um, and again, my guitarist was like, that's a good school in Manhattan. I went to FCI and um, got a job after school. And that's, that's, kind of, that's kind of how I fell into cooking. 